What is the world? Maddie Beeps here. Welcome back to the channel. And today this episode starts off in the restroom. There is a reason for it. I'm going to be getting rid of this beard. It is time to let it go. It's easy to grow back, but I think it's time to do a little maintenance. I've been kind of lazy, but it is time to trim it down. So I will see you guys when all this is off of my face. It's easy. And I'm done. Look at that. Never done a goatee before. So this is really weird. I feel like I have a circle just around my mouth. It's very weird. But I'm gonna try it out for a few days, see if I like it. But tonight, we're gonna be going to a screening of Ready Player One. I will be working it and using this camera to film my friend for a video that he's doing for this company that he works for. So I don't know how much I'll be able to vlog. Maybe I'll be able to steal some of that footage for the B-roll. So I hope you guys enjoy that. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys very soon. Chasers. I don't drink chasers, so that's fine. Yeah. Oh, look at all these people. Look, we should film them while they're filming. Hey guys, look. Wow, these are some real tourists in, in Los Angeles area. It's not a celebrity home, but it's a car. I know that's yeah. right. <laughs> It's real Los Angeles tourists. Wow. I've never seen them before. Dude. 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 They do exist. Oh my God. Wow. That's crazy. This now, that's our first stop. This is our first stop. But wait till you get the glimpse of the second the tour bus. <laughs> you only ever see them on TV. It's so weird. But that was pretty awesome. They looked at us. They, 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 looked, looked, they actually yeah. looked at us. That was crazy. Wow. They oh even spoke God. to us. Spo I, I heard something. I know. Yeah. Now she gave me something. She's like, I heard it. 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 I heard it. <laughs> Fresh junket all day today, and this is the perfect way to end it. I'm so excited to uh, watch this movie with you guys. I've only seen little pieces of it in 3D. I've never, we're still gonna watch it in 3D together for the first time. <laughs> I will tell you that Steven went and talked with James Cameron and really like uh, I thought about the, the process and how you wanted to use the 3D and bring the 3D out more at certain moments in the movie. And I've, you know, uh, I'm just so excited. So I'll come up and say hello to you guys afterwards. Enjoy the movie. Okay, really quickly, it was at this moment, right before the screening of Ready Player One, they played our commercial, the commercial that I made with my friend Nick and Gabby in front of all these creative minds, and it was just so fun to be able to see our work on the big screen. So, there it is. If you guys haven't seen it yet, I'll link it down in the description below. Let me know if you like it. That was incredible. The writing, the directing. The cinematography. You need to see this movie. <laughs> <laughs> Except the Oasis. Who is this Parzival, and how the hell is he winning? Find him. This isn't just a game. I'm talking about actual life and death stuff. The Oasis, the world's most important economic resource. And it's nothing less than a war. Just got done watching Ready Player One. It was awesome, incredible, a lot of fun. So I hope you guys enjoy it when you see it in theaters. See you guys soon. 
Hey, I'm Ernest Klein, the author of Ready Player One and one of the screenwriters of the upcoming film adaptation of Ready Player One. And I'm so excited for all of you guys to see it and see uh, how you respond to it on Stardust. Good morning, world. It is the morning after the Ready Player One screening, which was on the 16th, so that makes it Saturday the 17th. I'm on my way to Studio 60, which is in LA, downtown LA area. I'm going to be helping out one of my professors uh, from CSUN. It is an unpaid gig, but I love the guy and he's helped me out so very much, teaching me knowledge and helping me out with the equipment and everything. So it was a no-brainer to help him out. I know it's very early. I've only gotten four hours of sleep, but it's going to be a fun day. And there'll also be some old fellow CSUN students there. So it'll be really fun to catch up with them. And I don't know how much B-roll I'm gonna get you guys, but I'm gonna do my best to get as much as I possibly can. So I'm gonna get my McDonald's, then uh, get on the freeway, and I will talk to you guys soon. I'll see you in a bit. All right, so we're parking right now. I just found out, talked to a couple of the students that I know, or previous students, I think they graduated by now, but I talked to them. I'm gonna be operating the Red Scarlet, so I won't be doing this late, so that's kind of fun. I'll be a little bit more hands-on. So excited for that, but we are moving locations to get to the right parking lot, and if ever you've been on a set, you know that parking is always kind of crazy depending on where you're filming at, and today's just one of those days. So, should be a lot of fun. Let's get in there. Let's get parked. Let's get uh, familiar with this camera. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I know this guy ahead of me. He sees me talking to you guys. Or maybe he doesn't know I'm talking to you. I don't know, we'll see. What is up? So we're here on set and they're about to get rolling. We're on our first scene. We're going to be upstairs. This is a bedroom scene and the girl is just waking up in the morning. She's supposed to be feeling fresh, looking really cool. So we have two 650s pushing through a 6x6 diffusion frame, really soft light, just kind of emulating the sunlight. And then we have a joker, which is, I think it's an 800 or a 1K joker. And that's just pushing straight in, emulating the sunlight, the hard sunlight. So it looks really cool. We got some haze in the room as well. It's looking really good. I'm gonna be working on the B cam. They're not using that yet, which is why I'm able to vlog to you guys. But we are on our steady cam right now. We're gonna be moving around for that particular scene. They're gonna come back, put my camera, the B camera, on a Dana Dolly, come in and out, and also side to side, pick up those shots. It's looking good. I'm excited. Have a lot of fun. I'll see you guys soon. Peace. Analu, and you're on the set of my new music video, Body Moving. You know, it's going to be lots of fun, lots of dancing, lots of other stuff that I don't really want to, you know, give away, but it's going to be a kick-ass music video, so be on the lookout. All right, so vlog number 25 has come to an end. It's incredible to think that we've done 25 vlogs so far, but I couldn't have done it without you guys. So thank you guys for tuning in every single week. I'm so happy to have made it to vlog number 25 and to continue to keep vlogging. So I hope you guys enjoyed this week's vlog. I had so much fun taking you guys to the Ready Player One screening. It was incredible being able to meet all those cool creative people and also meeting the author of Ready Player One. Thank you again to Nick Major for thinking of me and bringing me on for this project. So again, if you guys like this week's vlog, you already know what to do. You know the drill. Go ahead and do a super jump on that like button down below. And also, if you're tuning in right now and you're not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button right down there. It's the red one. I'll wait a second. Go ahead. Sweet, thank you for subscribing. And also, don't forget to hit that bell button so that every Wednesday you're notified when I upload these vlogs. So again, thank you so much for tuning in. I'm Maddie B, the cinematographer, and I'll catch you guys on next week's vlog. Peace.